Well, the main topics I cover are the well, the life-threatening topics, which would be choking. So it would be prevention of choking. So they cut off the food. They supervise all um, eating times. You don't have a child running around with food in their mouth. And what to do if the child does choke. And that would be for a child, a small child, an infant. Also CPR, if the child's unconscious and not breathing, no matter what happens, you do your CPR and that would be for child and infant bleeding, head injuries, poisons, suspected fractures. I do spinal injuries because I've seen spinal injuries myself and uh, I would run over um, tick bites and insect bites, uh, anaphylactic shock, asthma, diabetes, epilepsy, febrile convulsions. So that's basically what we would cover and any questions, meningitis, and any questions anyone would ask. And if I don't have the answer, I will always get back to the person because I have a good medical background, so I will always be able to, I would research, I don't Google everything. So the course is a one day course and uh, it's a great opportunity to meet other childminders because nobody really understands the situation more than another childminder. It's very good to bounce idea, you know, things off and to get contact numbers and to have that network because it can be quite isolating and lonely if you're in your house minding children on your own. And as I often say to them, I say it at the beginning, take phone numbers, in, you know, enjoy the day, have a social day. I would continuously assess throughout the uh, course. So what I usually do is we look at it on the slides, I present it, then we practice, practice, and I will go around to each individual person. And if I don't feel it's, it's right, I'll just say now, I show them again, Dennis, show them how to do it, and then they'll practice and they'll do it again. It's just continuous assessment. I'll always continue to assess. So you get a paediatric first aid certificate and this certificate is valid for two years. After two years, you do a refresher. I would tell him or her that it was very practical and hands-on and that you learn a lot about children in this one versus other ones that you learn more about adult side of things and working in childcare as well. It was very helpful in that sense. I felt that Mairead covered all aspects of the child care from the infant to the toddler to the after school child which all courses would naturally cover and she had mannequins for the baby as well which showed you how to do CPR and choking and babies and I found it very interesting. It's really helpful and it's really great and um, it, help, it helps you a lot, the things that, especially for me, I'm the first time and it's, I'm new with this one. So it helps me, help me to see what's going to be in the future and meeting loads of uh, people around is great. Absolutely, definitely, if we're able to do the course. I would because it's very childcare orientated whereas a lot of other courses are very adult related. It's good to learn both sides, especially when you're learning when you're working with children. Uh, one hundred percent yes, it, it's gonna be helpful in the future and helpful for yourself and for for everyone doing the child minding and tsunami or everyone out there. It's Everything is new, yes, it's great, yeah, I learned a lot. Uh, basic training, procedures, and everything, yeah, I did. Me personally, no, but there were two other ladies at the course today that weren't um, first aiders um, before, and it would have informed them a lot, whereas it updated things that I knew already and may have forgotten. Um, there's a lot of information, but she kept it interesting. And, kept, and was able to answer lots of specific questions for people with dogs, for people with different um, ages of children. So she was able to she had knowledge of all children. I did immensely, and Mairead was great. I did. Yes. Yeah.